Hey guys, what's going on? It's Amy again with Bargain Mama. And today I have like a run thing for you. So I didn't even know what they had had for Father's Day. Really, um, I had gone a while ago to Walgreens and I saw one specific thing that I picked up for my husband because I just knew he would really like, but I didn't really look at the rest of their stuff. But you guys, like I went there yesterday because that is again where I get some of our little snacks from. I have little places that I get everything, like Walgreens, I get, like, these are my kids' absolute and my husband's absolute favorite snack, so I pick these little packages instead of the big ones up at Walgreens, because if you get the big ones, nobody will bag it, they will just take the whole bag. So I get these Dollar General, I get, like, their little chips and stuff like that, and then Walmart, I get certain things, and so we went to Walgreens to get the certain little snacks, because I've been gone for so long, and all of their... Father's Day stuff was 90% off. It was insane. Like, and then I have some other pictures to show you. They had um, some Pride stuff out, but even if you're like, oh, I don't do Pride, I don't whatever. I, like, nobody, I guess, knows it's Pride. They're beautiful. They have like nail colors, lip glosses. I mean, just beautiful things. And then, drum roll, they had a whole friends line there. And so I will put pictures of that at the end. I thought it was awesome. So yeah, it, um, they had like the names of the different um the different things in the show i thought it was cute they were all nail polishes it made me think of um bon bon's hauls because she loves nail polishes and she loves friends so um yeah it there was just all kinds of different colors i apologize if all of a sudden it gets loud my husband is playing the basketball game in our front living room literally just turned it on when i came in here to start doing this so Anyways, let's get on. So I will put a little bit of Dollar Tree at the end, um, but there's just a, like, there's a couple things from Dollar Tree and a couple things from Walgreens. So I just wanted to, oh, Larry, Larry, could you not play that right this second? He said, hold on, he's almost done. Um, so I guess I turned the TV down too much on him, so he went to do that. I'd rather him watch the TV in the living room here than play that game out there. Anyways, on to Walgreens. So this cup, I know it was 90 cents, so I think they, it was... They're having fun around here. <laughs> you're fine. I think it was like 9.90. I don't know. I'm horrible with math. If this is 90% off and it was like 90 cents, does that make it like nine $9.90 before? What? What does it make it? Ten dollars? Well, then don't laugh at me. Anyways, look at this cup. So I love that it says like real, the real is spelled like a fishing roll, cool dad. But you guys, like, I don't even know who I'm getting it for. I told my husband I just needed it because of this handle is the cutest handle. And we got it for 90 cents. So I think that is so cute. So cute. I did also, like I said, take pictures of some stuff that we did not buy. They had, um, makes it $9 beforehand? Okay. Um, you guys probably already knew that, but $9. Um, and then they had like a really cute chess set that was $1. It, that does make it $9 because if it was $10, then it would have been $1. So there we go. Anyways, um, I found these. I know I said I was not buying any more tumblers, but these are by Dashing Stainless Steel Travel Mug, 28.7 fluid ounces, and they are perfect. I love already the design on them. I can just use something with my Cricut for over that, put something on the top, has this right here that like releases some of the air. I paid $1.20 for these, so that means they were $12. Yeah, I'm getting it. I'm getting it. They're cute, and I'm gonna use them. But anyways, 120 for these, yeah. Anyways, then this is something, it's funny because I had bought my husband, which I'm very sad now, I had bought this for him at Walgreens a couple weeks ago for Father's Day just because he loves golf, and it had the color of the Dodgers, and it's very hard to find stuff for him. I thought this would be cute to put on his desk. Well, now they're $1.20 because I paid the $12 for this. Well, they're on the 90% off. So I thought since he had already opened it, I would show you. You can really put stuff in here. Yep, yeah, see, hide stuff. What do you mean it's hard to find stuff for me? Tools, guns, He's I Yeah, I'm not buying those. Um, so anyways, look at these pens. And again, they were $1.20 over there right now. Oh, oh, that's not how you, that's not how you take the lid off. Whoopsie, this is the lid. 
How cute is that? So anyways, these and these things do not just have to be for Father's Day. This is nothing Father's Day on it. It just has the cute little three pens with the putters and this golf bag. So cute. So those are actually the only three things I wanted to show you from Walgreens. Let's just hurry up and I'll show you really quick what I had gotten at the Dollar Tree. Again, all of them are 125. I got this. It's a large men's shirt. Um, it has the gray pockets. My son is a large, um, they're actually mediums, but for around the house, it's summertime. I got these cause yeah, I just liked it. And then I got these for me. So this one right here is an extra large. And I was thinking like to make like a pool cover up, like bleach, reverse bleach it or something like that. So I got this and this is by Fruit of the Loom. Who is the other shirt by? Um, it doesn't have a name brand on it which is fine, but anyways, this is by Fruit of the Loom, so I did pick that up. I picked up this one, which is an XL by Jersey's Dry Power. Again, I love oversized stuff, so I will just reverse tie-dye this, chop it up a little. Um, my favorite thing right now is chopping stuff up and like bleaching it and just seeing what happens. So I got this, just a gray t-shirt. Um, oh man, hold on, please. Okay, I picked this one up, and this is an XL also, right? 2XL by Fruit of the Loom. So again, a little pool cover up, something like that. I can use my Cricut and put something on the front of it, reverse tie dye it, just make it look really cute. It's sleeveless, which makes it perfect for the pool area. And then this one, I love, I love it. So this one right here is by Gildan, and it is the, um, what are they called? It says heavy cotton. I can't remember what they're called. They have a certain name for them. I don't know. But it has like the colored sleeves. Like it's like the baseball kind of tee. I think raglan. Probably not. Probably not. But anyways, I thought this was so cute. It has the sleeves like that. Amazing. I'm just going to show you a couple more things that I snuck up on the counter. And then I'm done. Like two more things. I picked up this one, the Wild and Free. I'm not sure if I've gotten it before, but I think this will be cute on one of my tumblers. Not this one, because it's brown, but um, one of my tumblers, I think it will be cute. It just says um, one piece stickers. So it doesn't say, it says everywhere safe, so it could go on glasses or anything. And then you guys, I want to show you this glass thing. I picked this up in a different um, haul and I made what I wanted with it and I loved how it came out. It was amazing. So this time I'm going to video it. And um, again, Amy at Bella's Bargains, she made one of these for her shower door like last year or something, probably over a year ago now. And like, I loved how she did that, but I never, I was like, oh, I don't have those kind of doors. It's not going to look good on mine. But when I saw this and I started thinking and she kind of made me think outside the box, I was like, oh my gosh. So I, what I did with it, with the last one is I glued where these circles are together. So these, you know, are suction cups in here, but I cut it where it was straight. And then I glued up the sides, like where these circles were straight. So I put glitter in there and then glued them. So all up the sides had glitter, like just in it. And then the inside you could put your purse and stuff in, or I'm sorry, your notebook, cause I'm making a notebook cover. But I think this time I'm just going to get like, um, uh, like the, paper or not the paper i'm sorry the vinyl the vinyl book covers oh maybe that's my amazon order the vinyl book um the vinyl whatever the slide in things um and then like line the inside of this with it and then glue every single one of these and put glitter in every one of these i'll show you it's very confusing but it's not confusing when i do it so i will video it and actually i think i'm going to video it tonight this video is coming up today the day i do it so i think that this one i will video tonight and it will come out on monday or tuesday because i also have um, a comparison of the dawn power wash to the palm olive power spray stuff coming out so between this one and that one, they will be coming up on Monday and Tuesday for you. Um, so anyways, I hope that you guys have a great day. I hope that you like some of my DIYs that I'm going to be showing you. Uh, nothing is really good at Dollar General right now for a penny, and I don't know what happened, but those are my videos that hit like through the roof on everything. Um, but there's just not really a whole lot going on there right now, and I can't bring anything else home. Yeah. So, all right, guys, I hope that you have a great day and I'll talk to you later. Bye.